Mary, the Tri-State's growing community of local food producers is gaining momentum this weekend. This weekend, you're invited to the Ohio Valley Green Market. Now, here to talk about the impact of this event is local 127 chef Steve Geddes. Welcome. Pleasure to be here. Fantastic. What are we in store for uh, this weekend? What's this all about? It's about sustainability and supporting local, the local economy, the local, uh, uh, the local bounty. And it's being just tying it into a, a, a wonderful community. The Ohio Edibles Communities has uh, uh, really created a special event for us here. And uh, I understand, I was just reading actually, that there are tons of farmers markets around the country and that number is growing. And so what you're all about is growing and people are interested in, in locally sourced foods. Well, in general, the closer your food is sourced to you, the, uh, the more sustainable it becomes from a variety of uh, standpoints. And most importantly, it tastes better and it supports your local farmers, your local economy. And, and it keeps the dollars home and it keeps no. the flavors tastier and closer to your palate. And environmentally better because we're not uh, running trucks all over the interstate to get it here. You know, we're not bringing the tomatoes in from Argentina. Yeah. So, you know, it helps a lot. It helps the, it helps the economy and it really helps the, uh, uh, the impact of, uh, of, of what's going on in nature in general. Sure. Uh, tell us a little bit about your restaurant downtown and uh, what you offer, what you do. Well, the restaurant is Local 127, and we're one of the sponsors for the uh, uh, the Green Market uh, event right. here. And uh, we source as local as possible to our to our restaurant base. We work with a variety of small farmers, uh, and this is how we became involved with the event. The event is really uh, special because it's going to bring uh, three days of special events. Today they have uh, uh, Mr. Uh, uh, Paul Willis, who's actually one of the great uh, pork a specialist that's doing pastured pork around the country. He's doing a hog roast tonight. Uh, tomorrow we have uh, a variety of floral demonstrations. And then on Sunday is a complete uh, market that is open to the public mm -hmm. with a variety of events, speakers um, that are really going to create a special event focusing yeah. on sustainability. And you can, I'm sure, learn a lot when you're there. Well, there'll be uh, speakers in a speaker tent. There'll be uh, a variety of uh, food uh, markets. There's going to be a, a children's uh, farmer's market for the kids to go play at. Um, it, it even deals with vehicles. You know, Ford sure. is going to be launching some of their electric uh, modern vehicles oh, there good. as well. Yeah. So it really is kind of more than just food. It's it's understanding our local uh, economy in general. Okay, uh, just let's wrap it up and tell me where it is again, uh, location-wise, and when it's going to be uh, uh, running. Well, tonight is, uh, uh, well, the big event is yeah. Sunday. The real big event is Sunday. And and it's Glen, Glenwood Gardens. It's the fantastic yeah. uh, uh, 3,000 acre Glenwood Gardens that are just incredible. It's uh, sprawled out throughout there and okay. uh, they'll have uh, all the events there. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Pleasure. Looking forward pleasure. to it. All right. Great.